Hi, it's Bonnie from Everything Country CA, and here is my vintage teacup thrift haul. I'll first show you some of the um, stores I went to two, uh, today just to check out what was happening out there, and I usually do a little tour in different areas of the city, so this time I went to two of my favorite ones, and uh, you know, I have to hunt around in these. Um, sometimes there's some really nice little vintage things like glassware and, and little jugs and things. But unless I'm thinking about reselling, it's not really worth my while to pick up everything, even though I do find some good vintage stuff. So um, I tend to just now sort of focus on my my tea party displays and my other enamelware. And that's what I, I look for and in the different color schemes. So... So yeah, unless it's a really good bargain or something I think I might flip later, I don't really go for it. But I thought I would show you a couple of the stores and what I typically see when I go out. And then at uh, a little bit later on in the video, you see my final haul and what I brought home. So I hope you enjoy that. Here's my latest teacup thrift haul from a couple of thrift stores I went to today. And at the first one, I got three orphan items. Um, one of them is a um, Romani rose, yellow rose teacup by Royal Standard. And then a Royal Albert purple saucer teacup saucer and just look at those purple flowers just gorgeous so i've been working on collecting some purple items for my purple display and then i found this paragon saucer and again it's missing the teacup but there it is so it's a commemorative one of the commonwealth so that was pretty cool and i'll just look around for for the matching ones I'm sure I'll eventually come across them and at the other place I found this American Beauty teacup and saucer for five dollars I found this other one which is called Mel Melba Melba bone china from England and it's got the purple um, lady there Almost looks like a French scene, but anyway, I'll have to look into that one. And that's beautiful, again, for my purple collection. And another purple one, I've never seen this one before, and this one is Royal Chelsea. So that's beautiful, and look at those purple flowers. So I'm really excited to finally find some purple teacups my goodness it's been a while and then this last one has purple and pink and it is wild geranium royal albert so really happy to find that and again each of those teacups and saucers were five dollars at that second location So I've got now three more teacup sets for my purple display, so I'm happy about that. And at the first location, I found this lovely vintage doily, and it's obviously an arm rest or something, or you could use it as a wall hanging, but it's got a pony on it, so it's so cute. I didn't even realize it had a pony until I got home. So there you go. Those were my finds today and I was quite excited. I'm always loving finding more teacups so I think I'm becoming a teacup fanatic. Um, 
if I aren't already. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that, and we will talk to you again soon, and hopefully you'll see a display with some of these in, in my display soon. Take care.